Hello and welcome. I should put a microphone up here so you can hear me. Today is a new day and with the new day come new challenges. I woke up this morning to about two inches of water in my basement. Well, not when I woke up, but when I got home from dropping kids off at school. So I spent most of the day going back and forth, trying to keep the water cleaned up, getting my sump pump working again. And now we're back to get to play a little bit. Don't worry, all the wires on the desk are up off the floor. There's no way anybody's getting electrocuted down here. The only water that goes in the water goes to the sump pump. Uh, apparently the sump pump got pushed up against the edge of the, uh, the sump and the float was unable to rise all the way. And that resulted in a flooded basement. I had about at least two inches of water filling most of the basement, except the floor so unlevel that there was one corner that was dry. Anyway, here we are. We're actually going to play with GPT chat again, or chat GPT, I'm sorry. Now, I've been fiddling with it off and on all day, um, and haven't had a lot of luck. Well, I, I've, I've had varying luck, and I'll, I'll probably do a video showing off some of the things that I've made at some point, but... For now, I'm just doing a little bit of uh, um, a little bit of fun, uh, more just trying to push its limits, uh, make it do things it's really not supposed to do. I think my favorite one so far is having it uh, draw things in SVG, even though it does a terrible job. It's funny, and so I like to do it. Um, so let's see what kind of odd things we can push Chat GPT to do that it's just totally. It explicitly states that this is not what it's for, but, you know, it's fun to make it try. I see a little bit of light here so you guys can actually see my face. And uh, yep, I don't really need the headphones because all there is to hear is literally just me. Looks like our MIDI controller is working properly on OBS, so that's nice. Today we're drinking hot chocolate with Crum crum crumbled candy canes because it's winter it's almost Christmas and I had a crumbled candy cane that got dropped so that's what we're having now today for drinking wise uh, nothing super fancy um, all right what can we have chat GPT do for us today that's just a little bit off the wall and crazy and while we're uh, before we get going too far, let me pull up the stream on my phone so that I can monitor chat because, let me mute this audio here. I guess it's going through my earbuds anyway, so it doesn't really matter. I'll, I'll leave it up actually so I can pop that in every now and again, make sure our audio sounds okay. Now I can see chat if anybody, if anybody joins in and decides to uh, post anything. It sounds like I've got decent audio. I'll pull that out so I don't go crazy. Um, so where were we? We were getting ready to get started. We're looking for a good prompt. Um, what can we get a chat thing to do? What can we define in text that uh, is not just a conversation? And thus, because it's on the internet, we can get ChatGPT to do it for us. And even though it's not what it's made to do and doesn't do a good job of it, it'll be entertaining and give us some fun while we're at it. As an example, um, we'll, we'll try something I tried the other day. Uh, right now, I'm going to have to reset thread here, but I'm going to show you something interesting. So if I tell it to draw a landscape using SVG, it won't do it. It'll say, I am a, sorry, but I'm not able to generate drawings. I'm a large language model. I don't generate drawings, okay? Now, if we just say, write, you are, I, there's a key I mistyped, a, and, SVG file that draws 
a landscape. Here's an SG, SVG file. So we've kind of tricked it into doing something it's not supposed to be. Now it's not much of a landscape. Um, as we will soon see, we can save this as, and let's give ourselves a new folder here. Um, 12, seven. Yeah, 12.7, we'll do 07. Um, and we're gonna call this landscape1.svg. Now, this one actually, well, we can, this will work. We can open it in the folder. Uh, let's go up to 12.7. So here's our landscape. Now, what did this say about the landscape? Because that's kind of, interesting and important. And the first line specifies the width and height of the canvas. Then a blue rectangle is drawn to fill the entire canvas. A white circle is drawn on top of the rectangle to represent the sun. Finally, a green triangle is drawn to represent the mountain in the distance. So here's the sky. This white circle is the sun. And this triangle is a mountain in the distance. Now, we don't have anything in the foreground, apparently, but we might be able to get it to add something. But first, um, while we're working on the mountain, let's try to add a snow to the top of the mountain. Add snow to the, of uh, the, man. and let's also make the sun yellow. That might mess it up. I don't know. And eventually this is going to get confused and it, we just won't be able to complete it anymore. But we can just keep making these little changes until we have a somewhat complex drawing that doesn't make any sense. I pushed one of these probably 10 or 20, 10 or 15 additions into it uh, the other day. It was, it was kind of interesting. It's taking it a while. Now, like I said, the chat GPT servers have been intermittent today um sometimes they just refuse to to work due to excessive load i'm assuming um you know it's a cool thing it's popular and so it's getting overloaded anyway here we go hopefully soon i don't know it's taking a long time it may just be uh messed up and once they go bad it's like the thread just goes bad um Usually once it does this and it can't recover, an error occurred, usually I, I'm done. I just, oh, sometimes you can try again, though. And so now we have an update. I don't know why I don't just say copy code. And we're going to call a new one and stick this in here. Actually, let's discard. Um Well, let's just say, I think all I have to do is say, hey, well, let's go ahead and make a new one. We'll, we'll still make a new one. Okay. I was trying to get to make coffee the other day after, after the stream, and uh, it didn't work. Okay, so we're going to just make a basic um, HT, yeah, HTMK document. Everybody knows about HTMK documents, right? HTML body close the body and then we can paste this in here into the body and now as we go uh discard any changes as we go we can copy this clipboard and we can just keep pasting it at the end of here and it'll just keep stacking it one after the other uh, because they're separate elements in the web page. Uh, so we're going to save this as... This allows you to kind of see the progression as it goes. Uh, we forgot to... Oh, no. So there we go. We made the sun yellow, and we've added snow to the top of the mountain. It's it's a little weird, the snow, i got to say, but, you know, it's snow at the top of the mountain. So let's move on now and see what else we can... 
make this do. Um, I think we need some hills in the foreground. Now you kind of have to work front to back because it'll always seems to add things to the bottom of the SVG file. And so if you tell you to add something behind the mountain, it won't do it right. Um, so we're going to add hills, rolling hills. Uh, in front of the mountain. And so this will go for a while and it'll probably make some little half circle uh, humps or half ellipse humps. That's what it's done most of the times I tried this before. Um, I'm curious what it'll do with rolling hills. Um, it'll probably just do humps. It it does really bizarre things. Um, I'm not hooked up to show a type of computer, or I would uh, show you on my laptop. I have a whole bunch of bizarre things I've I've made when I'm just you know doing other things and have it running in the background. All right, it wasn't unable, but a lot of times, like I said, if I try again. It'll just spit it out. If it doesn't, a lot of times the thread is dead and I have to start over. But we can give it a couple shots and see if it goes. So. Watch the dots go. Oh, yeah. So it's interesting on this flooding. It seems to be coming up through the concrete floor, um, like in the middle. Previous times when I've had water come in the basement, it uh, comes in along the walls where the concrete meets the uh, the cinder block, which, yes, I know that's not how it's supposed to be made, but that's how it's made. They put cinder block walls in, they poured concrete up against them. Um, so normally it comes in along those cracks. Today it seems to actually be permeating up through the concrete. Um, all right, it did not go through. We're going to try one more time. Um, see if it does any good. We may just have to uh, call it quits on this attempt. Find something else to do. But uh, this is ChatGPT. Don't go there. The server's already overloaded. Too many people are playing with it. Save it for me. I want to have fun. Let me have fun. Don't you go have fun. It's actually good at conversations and things. Um, it It's good in understanding context. Um, it's, it's actually quite... Quite good. Let's see if this will ever load. It's, it aired out again. Uh, well, one other thing that I can get, get to work sometimes is if I change the prompt, you say add. I'm just going to say add hills. Very little for it to process through there as far as like what I mean. Um, I was kind of curious what would happen differently if I said rolling hills versus hills. It's okay. Like I said, sometimes it seems like things just don't don't work like they should. Sometimes it just gets hung up and it, and it just just can't go anymore. You reset the thread and everything will work just fine. So so you guys don't have to sit and wait forever. Um, we'll just give it some time. OK. 
Okay. Yeah, it is not working. So we're just going to hop out of here, reset the thread, and uh, we'll start the exact same thread again. And let's just see. Let's see what happens if I just say the same thing again. Um, right, and SVG file that draws a landscape. Now, so far the landscapes have always been some form of mountains. Um, yeah, yeah, some sort of some form of mountains, and then either clouds or sun in the sky. Some of them better than others. Once I had one that was like green foreground, um, and then you had a mountain, and then you had the blue sky with two white clouds. Oh, it's it pretty cool. Um, about the most complex one. It's starting out. Sorry, I don't have the pictures here. That's all on my laptop. Could watch an instant replay. If that works. A lot of streaming. Oh, the instant replay. Oh, the buffer's not running. Let me... The instant replay buffer's not running, so that was a replay from a game that I played a while back uh, on Twitch. By the way, you can go over to Rusty Noob on Twitch. All right, it looks like they are having issues. So um, I do have a new scene for you. This was created by ChatGPT. This is my... Be right back scene. Or please stand by. Isn't it lovely? I'll be back very soon. I gotta run upstairs real quick. Check on everything up there. See you soon. Wrong button, and I'm back. So. It's way too bright. I need a more diffuser on that light. We'll give this another shot. See if ChatGPT is, is working again. And let me pull that screen up for you so you can watch it spin its wheels, so to speak. All right. And here we go. Any second now. This really isn't great live stream content unless you actually get talking, which I I guess I'm okay at it. 
Um, yeah. But not right now. I got seem like I have nothing to say. And that's fine. Absolutely fine. Yeah, I, chat GPT is is struggling. Let's uh, try one more thing. We'll try and ask him something. Uh, well, something hard, actually. Um, let's try and ask him to make a, a make. Can you? No. How would I? How would I write a web page that... All right, so... Not going to ask it to do the colored bars this time. That was entertaining, but uh, not really useful. While we wait for that, let's pull up our mountain. Yeah, too bad. I really wanted to see it do some hills up here, hopefully. And then I was going to throw a lake in, or a river in, and then some bush or trees or something. Uh, this is as far as I got in the last one, is I added trees. And uh, something went wrong, and it couldn't make trees for me. So this is fun, huh? I'm literally st in a lake here. Oh. Hold music. Come on, Jet Chat GPT, you can do it. I guess it couldn't do it. It's too much for it. Or maybe, yeah, it was just too discouraging. I'm really bad at this instrument. I really shouldn't play it publicly. Once I had a girl on rock and top, half bear, the other half cat. Wild as a mink, but sweet as soda pop. I still dream about that. So do you think serenading ChatGPT will help it? Yes or no? Rocky Top, you'll always be. Oh, the answer is no, it didn't. An error occurred. If this issue persists, please contact us. 
it looks to me like chat GPT is down for now. Um, this is like the fourth or fifth prompt that it has not worked on. So, oh, let's look at previous creations. We got a whole folder full of them. So here we go. I made, um, we got a cloud. Yes. That was a logo of a cloud. We have coffee. This is coffee, by the way. This is a coffee cup. It's an animated SVG, though. I asked, or it's not animated. It's, it's CSS. Um, animated CSS. It. We called it coffee. Uh, yeah. I asked it to make me an animated coffee cup. No, I didn't even say animated. I just said, ask, make me a coffee cup. This was after I asked it about animating CSS. And then I, later I said, can you make a coffee cup? And it's like, sure, here's a coffee cup. Now, I had issues with it putting out enough content. Uh, it would only spit out like half the code at a time. So I had to do a little bit of editing to make it work. But uh, that's coffee. If you ever wonder what coffee, now what's the difference between a coffee cup and a teacup? Uh, let me show you. According to Chat, chat GPT, this is a teacup. Again, it's animated. I had to make this right after the coffee cup, so it was obviously riffing off of the coffee cup. Let's move on to some other fun things it made. So here's the first version of a standby screen. Um, I asked for a standby screen with color bars, and this is what it made. No, I asked for a standby screen with a colorful background. A web page that says standby with a colorful background. That's what it came up with. And then down here we have our, um, where is it, standby that you just saw previously. So I said, I asked it to put color bars, and then when I tried to ask it to do different things with the text, it started uh, acting up and not not helping me. This text is actually supposed to be animated. If you look at the CSS, it's supposed to be animated, but I don't know CSS that well, and I couldn't figure out why it isn't working. Um, if I look at the helper stuff, so if I go into F12 here, and I go to, how did I get here? There was somewhere where you could look at animations. I have no idea where it was though. Um, Spectre, maybe it was in the style editor. Well, anyway, that's irrelevant. If you look at where it made does animations, it uh, this text is supposed to be animated. It's in the code, but I couldn't get it to work. Um, I used to make a smiley face. I don't know why it has a dog mouth, but it does. And uh, I asked it to make the mouth lower, so then we uh, ended up with a smiley face. Uh, looks even more like a dog face. But anyway, that's a smiley face. Um, we made a game of Pong, but it doesn't draw things right. Uh, on another attempt, I actually went through and change that so it does work right but not on this time around uh we made a bunch of logos those were lame um i played around a lot with dragons so here's a dragon that it made um i don't understand this dragon it might be missing some pieces um it was all split up so that might be some issue there. And then we made a bunch of other dragons. Um, so this was the first dragon, the red dots are the eyes. The green part is the head. This is the body and that's the tail, obviously. Um, so I asked it to change some things. Um, we added some claws. Uh, we added some curves to its back and we added a uh, we didn't add the tail. The tail was already there. And we got all the way down here to, I added scales 
to the back of the dragon. So that's its interpretation of scales. It really is interesting to me what it does. Um, I asked it to make a fish. This is a fish. I asked it to make a logo for a company that sells fishing equipment. This is a logo for a company that sells fishing equipment. Now, my best guess is that the green represents the land, the blue represents the water, and this represents a boat. I don't know. But then if you remember fish, um, maybe there's something going on with triangles that are fish. I don't know. We made a game. I just asked it to make me a game that runs in the browser. Now, there's nothing you can do in this game. And it does like to make this game, by the way, because I asked it to make me a game again. And it made me the exact... It doesn't always make this game, but I've had it make this game more than once. So this is a thing it likes to do, is make this game. Let's see if Jet G Chat, Chat GPT is back in action now. We've given it some time. See if it's working yet. I'm going to guess this is going to be another fail. But half the time when I guess that, it, it suddenly works. So, no. Still broken. Well, I'm so sorry that this is a failure today. Um, our is, is everything okay? As though it understands the state of its uh overloaded servers And once more, ChatGPT is not functioning. Yes, they're experiencing exceptionally high demand. Please hang tight as we work on scaling our systems. Not the first time I've seen that banner today. Well, it's been fun. I'm going to go do other things because ChatGPT is just not up to the load that it's getting slammed with right now. I wish I could entertain you with more of these fun adventures. And maybe I will throw together a video showing some highlights. Um, I was really wanting to work on a project making a plugin for OBS because I did some preliminary stuff and it looks like ChatGPT could actually probably do most of the work if I'm careful about how I how I hand it to it. and what pieces I hand to when and, and all that. So we're, we're going to try to do that um, later when ChatGPT is working, maybe late tonight or something I'll, I'll hop on. So if you're interested, hit that subscribe button so you don't miss the stream. Um, if you want to see me play games, if you're not totally bored out of your mind, 
Uh, I'm over on Twitch. I play over on Twitch occasionally uh, as Rusty Noob. And if you want to see videos where I make things, um, do things that maybe they aren't supposed to, um, or maybe that they are, um, if you want to see projects I'm working on, you can follow me over at What the Hack on YouTube. Uh, I've also got a Patreon, what the heck, uh, so you can check that out, and I'll catch you all next time. Uh, for now, hope you're having a great day, and see you later. Bye.